We today are making a CBD salve. So we have Amanda, the owner of the herb shop on North Mississippi. She teaches all kinds of classes uh, a few times a month, really, to learn all kinds of different things. And today we are making a CBD salve. Is this something easy enough people could make at home? Absolutely. You can pick up the products yourself already made and infused, and then you can just mix it together with some beeswax and you have your salve. So what do we have in the pot so far? So we currently have select CBDs, unflavored CBD oil, and a little bit of beeswax. Okay, and the CBD oil, just to be clear, so there's CBD and there's THC. They both come from the hemp plant, but what does the CBD do? So they both come from the marijuana plant, but the, um, the CBD is great for helping to ease any pains in the body um, you, you know that's how I like to use it mm -hmm. um, so it's just it's another way that's hot on the market as far as the products that are coming out from beverages to salves and so it's used in that way yeah but CBD will not get you high it is totally different from THC also totally legal yes it's hundred percent legal in the United States right now okay so so far we've got the beeswax in there with the CBD oil and it looks like the wax is starting to melt. Yeah, it's starting to get a little melding here. It'll take it a few minutes for that to become one solid unit. Mm -hmm. And then what else do we get to add? And then we're going to add a couple other oils that we make here at the shop. We've got some arnica oil and some hops oil. Um, and then we also have our Muscle Ease rub that has poplar and a couple of these other ingredients, kava, to help ease some pain. Okay, are you pouring that one in there? Mm -hmm. Okay, We've got the muscle, what did you call it? Muscle it's muscle ease. Muscle ease. I went skiing a couple days this weekend and I have some sore muscles, so this sounds very handy. Yeah, great. This is some hops, so just like the hops that you get for brewing, they have lots of nervine properties, so it can help with relaxing the body when it needs that. Uh -huh. And then we have arnica, which is an old time favorite used in lots of ancient cultures for um, you know, easing pains again, bruising, muscle ease, things like that. All seem very useful for this time of year. Yeah. And so you just mix this all together. What, does it smell good? Does it have a scent? Yeah, it's great. I mean, you can add any essential oil you want, but these have a nice aroma just from the plants themselves. And then we can also add a little bit of lavender, a little bit of rosemary to add a little extra flavor in there. Okay, so while we keep mixing this up, so again, it's a CBD salve, so where would you use this? Anywhere on your body? Um, I personally like to use it uh, anytime I have sore aches and pains. So, you know, anytime I have joint pain, going skiing, playing, mm -hmm. you know, on the mountain, going for a long bike ride, you know, I like to personally just use it that way at that time. When the, when the weather starts to get nicer out like it is right now, exactly. we all want to go do active things and then we'll probably end up with sore muscles. And that's right. We want to go play and have some fun. Yeah. So yeah, be ready to ease the pain. Okay, so you keep mixing and wow, really all the wax has has totally yeah. melted in there with the CBD oil. And then the final step, you would you let it cool and then you pour it? Um, so typically you're gonna let it cool down to about 80 degrees and then you're gonna add the essential oil. So there's a candy thermometer here if you wanna put that in there. Um, and you would just watch it till it gets down to 80 okay. and then you'll add your essential oils. That's gonna actually hold it in there a whole lot better. Uh -huh. So. And then when you finish it up, then basically you just pour it into one of these that's Get the little right. container ready That's to right. go. You're going to pour it into that container and you're going to end up with a, a great solid. You're going to let it sit overnight so that way it doesn't get any bubbles or anything strange like that. Mm -hmm. um, and then, yeah, you have your salve and it's ready to go. That seems so easy. I'm ready to have some sore muscles now. Again, we're at the Herb Shop on North Mississippi. If you want a bunch of tutorials to make all kinds of different things at home, you go to herbshop.com. Um, you can go to the herbshoppdx.com. Herb PDX. Perfect. Thank you. Back to you. It's easy and it's effective, but you got to know how to mix what, though. Like That's in a fog now. Yeah, Her totally expertise easy. comes in. Yeah. All right, Cassidy, <laughs> thank you.